The bandit is finally gone. We are free. Balance changes are dropping September 7th and here is what to expect. First of all, all the ability texts are gonna be simplified. For example, Dissipate is gonna be changing to Energy Drain. Now for heroes, the Barbarian King will get unstoppable when he has the 1 HP shield to give him a chance to pull a one final super before he dies. Nature Board. Now the starting energy will be zero and the base HP of both forms will be reduced by 5 HP. The Royal Champion is getting a base hit speed increase from 0.6 to 0.75. The Wave Master is getting a bunch of nerfs. The super ability is gonna get a reduced stun of minus 0.5 seconds. The flip will lose two energy on base level and the second ability now the stun is changed into a three second slow and will only target up to three minis instead of five minis. Now for the bandit she's getting minus five HP, minus one HP per upgrade and the dash will no longer get two energy absorbed at base level. The super damage is increased to five and the second upgrade instead of a stun it will get slow for three seconds. The dagger goblin is getting a ton of buffs. Attack damage increased from three to four, base HP increased from 10 to 11, HP per upgrade is increased from five to six, the base skill in CDS triggers after three seconds instead of four seconds and it will also get the bonus movement speed to 100% instead of 50%. Now the first upgrade is an anti-heal upgrade and the third upgrade will get a buff making the invisibility last three seconds instead of two seconds. The golden giant's second upgrade now heals him and also grants him block for three seconds. The third upgrade the KO no longer heals but it also now grants block to all the nearby allies and would also give them unstoppable. The healing ranger starting energy was increased from 1 to 2. The final upgrade this unstoppable duration is now 5 seconds instead of 3 seconds. The ice wizard got a nerf to his final ability. The clash will now give your allies 8 shield instead of freezing them. The fisherman is getting a rework. Attack speed per star was increased to 0.1 from nothing. Hook range was reduced from 4 tiles to 3 tiles. That means he will not be able to pull the farthest row away from him. But the hook will always pull 4 tiles now without needing the final upgrade. And since the final upgrade is now a part of his base kit, the final upgrade on the fisherman will be changed to isolation bonus plus 3 damage to isolated enemies. Magic Archer is getting some sort of a nerf. The base attack speed was increased from 0.55 to 0.6 and the attack per level was reduced from 0.15 to 0.1 nerfing the 3 star magic archer but buffing the early stages of him. The mini P.E.K.K.A is getting a buff, critical chance was increased to 50% from 40% to make all the critical chances in the game the same number. The Mega Knight is getting an attack damage increase from 1 to 2 but this line on his third upgrade is getting removed. The P.E.K.K.A the third upgrade was changed from 3 times critical damage to plus 4 attack. Prince is getting a whole rework. Base HP was increased from 18 to 20. They removed the stun on charge miss. The attack on the pony was increased from 1 to 2 and the pony will no longer knock back or stun the enemies. The royal ghost is getting a buff. Don't worry, it's not like a big buff. It's just HP was increased from 10 to 12. The spear goblin. The second upgrade was changed from boast to anti-heal on his clash ability for 8 seconds. The valkyrie. She's getting a base HP increase from 25 to 28. The first upgrade is now 4 times damage to shield instead of 3 times to make it consistent with the dart goblin. The wizard. Base attack damage was increased from 2 to 3. Base attack speed was reduced to, from 0.4 to 0.3 and the anti-heal duration was increased to compensate for the attack speed reduction. The witch is getting nerfed. The skeleton HP was reduced from 4 HP to 3 HP and the upgrade was also reduced from plus 4 HP to plus 3 HP which I think was necessary because 8 HP skeletons was way too much. So what do you think of the changes? What would be the next meta? Let me know in the comments down below my dude.